Doing something like this is a little bit out of my comfort zone. I can do squats in them. It's originally from Primark. It looks like an ASOS label. So yeah, not bad. Might just lunge my way into lunch. Bargain winner. Hello my angels, how are you? Welcome back to my channel. If you are new to my channel, my name is Sophie, aka Sophrina, and I make a lot of fashion videos for you. So today is basically a huge everything5pounds.com haul, that is a mouthful, and I'm going to show you a load of things I purchased online at everything5pounds.com. Literally everything is five pounds. I know I don't need to point out the obvious, but I got so many things. And without rambling on too much, let's get started. So here we go, a huge, huge box full of goodies. So item number one I got is these sunglasses and these are cat eye leopard print sunglasses. Hopefully they fit, I do have quite a big head. Um, you can see my ring light in them, sorry about that. I like them, I think they're actually really cute. For five pounds, not bad. Sunglasses can be super duper expensive. I tend to never get high-end brand sunglasses. Getting that Audrey Hepburn vibe from them. I really like the rims, they're like a lighter brown colour with this animal print on them. Super duper. Okay, so next up we have this jersey grey dress and it's like an off-the-shoulder dress with these flower prints on them. I actually really like it. It does feel a little bit big, um, like it could slip down easily. I am wearing a bra, by the way. I think I have figured out something out about this website that I don't know if I should say to you or not. A lot of the items, they seem to have cut out the label of where it's originally from, and this is originally from Primark. I can see the P and I can see the K. And also, it feels like such a Primark. You guys know I love Primark. It feels like an item of clothing from Primark. This is just me figuring something out. I have not got in touch with everything5pounds.com and found out for definite. I really hope no one sues me for this. Please don't, I'm just a nice girl from London. But it is from Primark and I'm starting to think is this a way to get Primark delivered online? Like, is this Primark online in secret? Have I figured out the biggest thing that every girl and boy in the world wants, which is Primark to be online? I purchased this in a size 10. I'm normally a UK size 8, so that's probably why it's a little bit big. My next item is these cherry print flare shorts. I'm wearing black knickers, so it probably is not doing me justice. I think you can see the knickers through my shorts. I'm normally not too much into shorts because I'm quite self-conscious of my body, so I normally like to wear skirts and things like that, but these shorts are actually really cute and the little frilly bits at the bottom are doing my legs favours, I think, anyway. I do have like an irrational fear of white shorts. I feel like if I was wearing white shorts and Mother Nature called, we've got a problem. Also, as you can see, there is quite a bit of give in the waist area. They are a little bit too big for me. I did purchase these in a size small. I'm definitely not an extra small, so I do like them. I absolutely love the cherry prints on them. I think they kind of look like PJ shorts, like I could wear these to bed and they would look like pyjamas, so I don't know. I think they're cute for only five pounds. A perfect little item for holidays. So the next item is this little red number. Do you know what? When I ordered it, I thought that's a bit risque because I'm not really like a risky person. Like I don't class myself as like a super sexy girl. Um, I kind of dress like a 12 year old all the time. Wearing something like this is a little bit out of my comfort zone, but actually, I don't mind it, like it's not upsetting me, it's actually quite nice. For five pounds it is not bad, it is the perfect dress to wear on like a beach holiday, it will be really nice with a tan, as you can see I'm literally Casper the Friendly Ghost, I am so pale. The only thing I'm a little bit self conscious about is my tummy area, I don't think I'd want to wear it after I've eaten. I couldn't work out where this dress originally came from because the label has been completely torn out. But I did purchase this in a UK 8, so it is very, very fitted. Okay, so I also ordered some underwear. I mean, 
I'm just asking for trouble if I order underwear from a five pound store. Do you know what? Like, I'm, obviously I'm not gonna try this completely on online because it's see-through. It's this white set. For a set of underwear, a bra and some French knickers, I am actually really impressed just for five pounds. It feels like really good quality. The only thing I dislike about the bra is it's a little bit padded. I already have big enough boobs. I really, really dislike padded bras because I just feel like Pamela Anderson. You know, I'm not rocking that look to be fair. Um, so yeah, I'm actually really, really impressed with how this looks and feels. So I also ordered some workout gear from everything5pounds.com and I'm actually quite impressed with this. I really like the pattern and I really like the feel. It comes as a set, which I think is amazing. So basically, £2.50 for a top and £2.50 for the workout leggings, the matching leggings. You cannot go wrong with such a bargain and it feels like good quality stuff. And right now I'm really self-conscious about my body so I thought I'm going to order some workout stuff and hopefully that will entice me to do some workout. If you do know like a really good cardio type workout YouTube channel, please link it down below for me. But I'm actually really impressed with this. I like the colouring. I like really jazzy out there type workout gear. Don't know why. You might be able to see this label hanging out the front and it's from a brand called Holala. 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 Probably saying that wrong. Right, the next item is, I don't know if I love it or hate it. It is this gingham print crop top and it's got these ruffles here. I think it's quite cute. I don't really like the material. It feels like that weird, really low quality toilet paper material and it's like a bit stiff, but I think it's kind of a cute top. Um, it'd be perfect for, with some like high waist white jeans. I kind of like it. It's a bit of a weird fit. Like I feel like it's not coming down. It's like going, oh, you nearly saw my bra there. It's going up and up and up every time I move. Don't really like the sleeves. To be fair, I'm not keen on this top at all. It makes my arms look like hairpins coming out. It's actually from a brand called SHK Paris. I've never heard of this brand before in my life. The next item is this pink stripey off the shoulder top. You guys know I love my off the shoulder tops. This is a bit of an odd top, I must admit. It sounds really loud, like when I'm walking. Do you know what I mean? Like it sounds really, really super loud. So the material's a bit weird, but actually I think it looks really cute. For five pounds, I think it looks really, really super cute. It's going to be perfect for the summer and the top itself is quite long. Like it's almost like a dress, but it would be perfect to wear with some denim shorts or some white jeans and some sandals. So not too bad. I love how it's so stretchy, like so much gip. So if you did have like much bigger boobs, you could wear this and it would fit nicely. I love anything off the shoulder to be fair. I think off the shoulder things in the summer are perfect. Let's see if I can find out where it's from. It's from a brand called Voyals and I've never heard of that again in my life. I don't think I actually mind these too much. I thought I hated them. What do you think? These, by the way, I looked on the label and they are from Tesco. I know they are because I recognise the label. They come just above the ankle and they're actually not bad. Like, I thought I hated them because they're like these square jeans, but actually on they're quite figure hugging. So it's not too bad to wear with something like this. I like the stretchy quality, they feel very stretchy, very comfortable, I don't mind them. I'm not bad at all, I think for £5 a nice good quality pair of fitted jeans is pretty good, not bad at all. These were a UK size 8 and they fit perfectly, I can do squats in them. Right, I ordered another workout gear because like I just said I need to get my ass into gear and I quite like this one although what I will say it looks better than how it feels like I think it looks quite cool I like the bright pink the material feels really sweaty Betty and I feel like that is the opposite of what workout gear should be it should be like breathable and nice whereas the trousers are making my legs sweat a ton already and I'm not even working out the brand is some brand called Yazika 
Yaz Inka. So it's a bit of a random brand yet again. And I don't mind it though, I think it looks really cool. And I would suggest having a look at everything fivepounds.com, getting yourself a nice workout gear because you do get the top and the bottom. So yeah, not bad. Might just lunge my way into lunch. Ta-da! I love this. I literally love this. This is a shirt dress and it's polka dot theme, which I love. You guys know I love my polka dot theme. I think this is amazing for five pounds. I looked on the label and I'm telling you now, it's been cut out, but I'm telling you now, it looks like an ASOS label. So I feel like if this is ASOS and I've just paid five pounds for a really nice dress, I am super happy. I think that's such a good bargain. It looks really flattering. It's a really, really nice fit out of everything I've tried on so far. I honestly think this is my absolute favorite. Is it your favorite? Comment down below and let me know. Bargain winner. Also, I purchased mine in a size small, which is like a size, it worked out a size eight to 10. So it would fit a size eight to 10. When I hold my arms up, it doesn't rise up and show my whole derriere. Okay guys, so that is everything in my everything, fivepounds.com haul. I hope you enjoyed. I'm actually going to finish the outro wearing the polka dot dress because it was my ultimate favorite out of everything I ordered. What was your favorite? What would you keep? What would you return? What would you like? What would you dislike? Let me know in the comments below. I always get back to you guys. Thank you again for watching. If you're not already, I would love it if you could subscribe down below because it means the world to me guys. It really does. And I will see you in my next video. Bye.